number one team. Functional interfaces are used. Okay. They used to, to call the lambda of expressions. So it is predefined okay, for a functional interface. Predicate is used. Predicate is used to to use it to avoid, use it to implement, implement business logics or condition checks. Predicate is used to, to implement business logic or conditional checks. Business logics are conditional checks. Okay, that is we can we can replace the wherever you have okay, conditional checks are there. We can replace this conditional. Okay, we can replace with predicate team. That is wherever, 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 you know, conditional, conditional checks, conditional checks are there. We can use, we can use predicate. Wherever conditional checks are there, we can use this predicate team. We can use this predicate now here see now here already okay we have okay, discussed it yesterday how this okay predicate okay, interfaces are there now public okay, interface interface predicate public interface predicate so here what method is there yesterday there is a method is called public boolean test go here what is the input here here input is okay input is t we can give anything here that's it thing now here is good how many methods are there okay, inside of this okay, pre okay predicate how many methods are there okay inside of this predicate we have one method is called test Another method is called public boolean only boolean. Okay, we have different methods are there. Okay, inside of this some um, predicate. Next one is next one is and and r and method and method and method is okay. Input is predicate. Go for your Eclipse. Yesterday we have seen many examples on this predicate. What are the methods are there? One is test method. Another one is negate 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 another one is and up and operation another one is r operation another one is is equals is equals and operator our operator is equal to t see go for this predicate go for this predicate see what are the methods are there what are the methods are there negate negate okay does not have any like input and r and R and R these two are okay, input is predicate only last one is equal to T last one is equal to T you have to give here it is called but if you okay, if you observe and is okay written as a predicate R is okay written as a predicate negotiate also is okay negate also is okay, okay written as a predicate T you have to know this when you should go for this predicate, this called, you know, predicate joining team, okay, depends upon the requirement, you should go for this predicate team, okay, depends upon the requirement, you should go for this predicate team. So, we have 
seen here almost all are called all are called so here now it is all are called predefined methods from the predicate interface predefined methods from the okay, predicate interface so if you are a okay, interface okay, if it is a functional interface functional interface means only one abstract method okay functional interface means only one abstract method but multiple default methods multiple default methods okay now here these are called like a default methods here if it is negate means just to for okay reverse it is okay, negate means just to for okay, reverse it is okay, reverse it is you can give here negate the negate nothing is there here negate so now okay, we will see how this okay, static method will be asking okay, it is called okay, abstract method if functional interface will have single abstract method it is called at the rate single abstract method so it is also called default methods default method it is also called default method it is also called default method equals means it is a static method now okay study we saw okay, examples on abstract and default now we'll check a static also how it is works team now okay we'll see how it is works this static also it is simple one team how to work with this static okay wherever okay swap is there just I am commenting SOPs because I am writing new one. Replace all. That's it. Okay, team. Now we will start. Okay, next one, team. Okay. Predicate is equals is equals method is equals method. How to work this? Okay. predicate string p p name s colon s dot s dot okay s colon predicate dot predicate dot is is equals to team so we have to write predicate dot is equals predicate p is equal to predicate dot is equals you can give synotech or you can write now you can write system dot out dot to print ln Ename dot test of test of you will pass any input. It is okay because you are verifying here this condition is equals of instead of you will write your business logic if dot equals dot all use predicates wherever it is required. Try to avoid this if conditions use this predicates team. Now here see, run as Java application. That's it. That's it. If you give any okay, input is wrong, run as Java application. That's it. So you got the okay, error team. Okay, you got the okay, error. Now we have seen what is the importance of predicate. Now next one team 
So as of now, so here, 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 predicate. Okay, okay, input argument is, okay, input arguments are only one. Predicate, okay, input argument is only one. So sometimes what happens, sometimes, okay, okay, input arguments, okay, input arguments may be more than one, more than one, more than one. See, if okay, input arguments is more than one, then, 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 sometimes if the okay, input arguments may be two, two arguments, may be two, then, we should use, then we should use by predicate, then we should use by predicate, by predicate. By predicate, same story team. What is by predicate? What is by predicate? What is by predicate? So now here see, by predicate will use. It will okay. It will take two input arguments will take two okay, input arguments okay it is also used it is also used it is also used to to do the to do the conditional checks it is also used to do the conditional checks it is also used to do the conditional checks okay how this by predicate will work now here see Syntax interface by predicate public Boolean test team T T comma U U team T T U U So what we should do here immediately should give t comma u t we should give t comma u please try to understand so here what is my okay what is my okay requirement okay requirement is okay different requirement is how to okay requirement is okay different team okay requirement is if you are okay if you are okay okay input arguments are two if you are okay, input arguments are two, then you should go for, then you should go for by predicate, by predicate. I will show you practically by predicate in time. Here, interesting one is here. Okay, interesting one is by predicate, by predicate. What are there is no equals method? Why here equals method? Okay, return type is equals method argument is see here object reference it is not supporting for two see you cannot compare with two object reference right you cannot compare with two object reference right that's why here doesn't have any now here equals method here let us see practical on this okay, example by predicate by predicate by predicate demo the input arguments are two what i should do by predicate integer integer is equal a comma b we can give a plus b divided by 2 equal to 0 
equal to 0. See how the small okay, requirement is there. Now how to do it here? System dot out dot print ln. A comma B. System dot out dot print ln. E dot test of n comma true output is true always output is either true or false if you give 21 output is false if you give okay, 21 is okay, output is false here depends upon the requirement you should go for by predicate or you should go for predicate if you see what are the methods are there inside of this you have test one you have and and means it is a by by predicate only you can pass two arguments here and means by by predicate only you can pass in two three arguments here okay it's not a problem see earlier predicate joining now here by predicate joining means two three by predicates you should okay, test it okay that's it so negate is already same or but, but here is equals is not there it is is equals is not there here understood team how to write here how many methods are there here have a high level here there are only four methods are there one is the test method one is test method other one is other one is other one is and operation other one is R operation other one is R operation other one is negate negate team other one is negate other one is negate team and operation R, R operation other one is okay negate team other one is negate team that's it okay depends upon the okay, requirement you should go for okay, de okay depends upon the requirement you should go for you should go for either predicate or by predicate team okay, predicate or by predicate team okay, understood team now okay, next one okay, next one okay, that's it team and or same for okay, everywhere now okay, next one team okay important there is a concept is called in JDK 8, uh, JDK 5, one concept has okay, implemented, one concept has implemented auto boxing and auto unboxing. Auto boxing and auto unboxing. What is the use of auto boxing and auto unboxing? Here I have a primitive, here I have a wrapper object. Here I have a primitive, here I have a wrapper object. Now what happened here? I have a primitive means int is equal to 0. I have a wrapper means integer i is equal to 0 or whatever it is. The process of Converting primitive to wrapper object. The process of converting primitive to wrapper object, wrapper object, wrapper object is called auto boxing. Is called auto boxing. The process of converting primitive to wrapper object primitive to wrapper object is called auto boxing is called auto boxing the process of converting wrapper to okay, primitive wrapper to primitive is called auto boxing the process of 
converting wrapper to primitive wrapper to primitive is called auto unboxing is called auto unboxing understood team now let's see the use case let's see the use case so now we'll take some simple examples team then we'll see predicate primitive demo get primitive demo now here see team small small example i will take small example i would take index int int array int array x is equal to int array x is equal to you would see 10 comma 20 comma 30 comma 40 comma and 50 team okay now predicate now predicate integer i am expecting here okay integer p is equal to p is equal to i i colon i percentile 2 is equal to is equal to 0 is equal to 0 okay it is a one simple condition team if this condition would satisfy okay if this i want list i want all the list what are this condition would satisfy i want all the list x1 x x here now if p dot test of x1 x1 system dot out dot print l x1 okay output will come for sure run as java application see what is the output 10 20 what is the output 10 20 30 40 50 whatever values are available here all all values are available here 10 20 30 values are available here all values are available here so it is a simple one but what is the drawback here you know the drawback is please try to understand the drawback is you are passing an you are passing an okay you are passing a primitive you are passing an primitive okay, primitive but here here what will be happen here since it is an integer it should converting to integer it should converting to okay, integer since you are okay you are passing an since you are passing an you know you are you are passing an okay, integer so all you are passing primitive how many elements are there 30 you know five five elements are there this five elements five times five elements five times auto boxing would be there five elements five times auto boxing means it will be converting from integer to it will be converting from integer to your you know into to your integer team five times this primitive value should be converting into integer primitive value should be converting into integer t now what happened see okay you got the okay into two okay, integer okay but after this business logic it will be happen again it is an what value integer value again it is what value into value again this into value should be converting into integer value again this into value should be converted into okay, integer value team so every time every time it is happening it is happening auto unboxing 
and it is happening auto unboxing team every time it is happening auto boxing and also okay, every time it is auto okay, unboxing team to overcome these kind of problems to overcome these kind of problems they have introduced a concept is called they have introduced a concept is called primitive primitive predicate team primitive predicate team primitive predicates here okay team now what are the okay primitive predicates are there so now here there are okay primitive predicate so while while performing performing conditional checks developer developer forcing developer forcing to do forcing to do auto boxing and auto unboxing developer forcing to do while performing conditional checks while performing conditional checks conditional checks developer developer forcing to do auto boxing and unboxing while performing forcing to do auto boxing and unboxing which will cause it will cause the it will cause the performance issue it will cause the performance issue it will cause the performance issue while performing conditional checks the developer forcing to do auto boxing and auto unboxing which will cause the performance issue which will cause the performance issues okay to overcome these problems to overcome these problems okay to overcome these problems we should use we should use primitive primitive predefined primitive predicate interfaces primitive predicate interfaces to overcome these problems we should go for primitive predicate interface we should go for primitive predicate interface what are the primitive predicate interface one is one is again to predicate one is into predicate another one is long predicate long predicate another one is double predicate double predicate team into predicate long predicate double predicate team that's it now we'll see if you have the examples about into predicate okay, double predicate long predicate that's it if you know this okay, nothing is there in here so above the problem is n number of auto boxing and okay, unboxing it would be happened so it will be means number of times your business logic would be executed that many in times this auto boxing and okay, unboxing would be okay, executed to overcome these problems you should go for into predicate long predicate you know primitive predicate interfaces these interfaces will take care internally auto boxing and unboxing instead of developer enforcing manually how to do simple okay, example it is okay, okay interfaces it is how many okay, interfaces are there three interfaces are there okay, example see for this example now we did all this stuff right just i'm giving comment okay that will not execute okay that's it now we'll see here into predicate to do into predicate 
into predicate okay into predicate p is equal to ip is equal to ip is equal to i so in percentile 2 is equal to 0 0 now what you will do for index same logic whatever logic is there. I'm not doing anything here same logic what extra I am doing here into predicate I arrow I percentile 2 is equal to 0 so int x1 x here ip dot test x1 that's it so now what happened here no need to do the because it is also okay supporting for okay integer only primitive only you no need to perform auto box operations means no need to perform your primitive to object your primitive to wrapper object once you got the output of this okay, result here, results also is an okay, integer only. Earlier here, here okay, result is an integer. Result is into here. Earlier you are passing value is okay, into here. Here okay, x1 is, x1 is okay, into value here. If x1 is into value here, if x1 is okay, into value here, what they will do every time this x1 should be converting into integer that integer will perform the operation the result also it will be an integer means while 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 passing the arguments is also converting your into to integer after you got the result also it will be an int only again this int should be converting integer earlier no no need all where everywhere it is primitive only now no need everywhere it is primitive only now understood team now see if i run the application run as that's it only th thing is to improve your performance okay to avoid unnecessary auto boxing and unboxing will be there they introduced a concept is called primitive predicate interface primitive predicate interface similarly similarly it should be double predicate team any questions team any questions team this is the concept is called a predicate any questions okay, shall we write a summary on this predicate team okay, quickly Shall we write a summary on this okay, predicate team quickly? Yes, sir. Yeah. First point team. Predicate is used. Is used to is used to apply. Apply conditional checks. That is that is try to avoid if, if statements try to avoid if statements now second one team what is second one see there are three types of predicate interfaces one is one is Single arguments. Another one is two arguments. Two arguments means by two arguments. Another one is two argument. Now third one is third one is single argument. Two argument. Third one is primitive predicate interface primitive predicate single argument two arguments third one is 
primitive. Third one is primitivity. Okay. Third one is primitive predicate interface. If it is a single argument, now here, now here, okay, okay, what happened team? Simple it is predicate. The interface is only one. Interface is only one. So okay. Okay, input okay, argument is only one. All these okay, predicate interfaces are okay, written type is Boolean. Boolean. Whereas here team, as we know, input arguments are two. Depends upon the requirement, you should apply either single argument or multiple arguments. Now here, there is no need, no need, no need of input arguments here. I mean, no need to type here. It will take care. It will take care. Sorry, it is an interface. I am sorry. It is an interface. I am sorry. Okay, here, here into predicate, a double predicate, long predicate. There are three types of okay, predicate are available to you. Into predicate, long predicate, okay, and double predicate team. Okay, now done. See now, try to understand team. Now here, see how many methods are there team here. Here we have a single abstract method. Here also single abstract method of everywhere is there okay, test is there wherever you should go for because if it is a functional interface means compulsory okay okay you should have a okay, single abstract method here you would have here what is there here and is there and is there here also same and is there here and is there here you will see r here you will see r go for here here also you will see r here also you will see r okay, next one negate team negate how oh, this same negate negate is here here negate is available here we can give happily let's see if it is into predicate see here test is there and is there r is there but you know here okay, negate also is there only equals is not there is is equals is available only here only with one argument is equal not available here is equal not available here that's it team that's it okay done any questions on predicate team if you don't have any questions then we'll start our another predefined of interface is called function team another predefined of interface is called function team yeah now we'll see very very important topic is called function predefined predefined functional interface another one is called function another one is called function function is now here see mathematical word like predicate see here custom point function is exactly same as a predicate function is is an is an function interface is an function interface number two it is exactly it is exactly same as it is exactly same as predicate it is exactly same as the predicate but but you now here yeah. 
function returns function returns any value any value is exactly same as a predicate function returns any value but predicate always returns predicates always return boolean value predicate always return boolean value function return any value but predicate always returns boolean value t predicate always return boolean value t boolean value example this what is syntax this okay, function interface function you will have input comma output predicate why output is not there it is always boolean why do you need this again specify here boolean but function input may be anything output also is may be anything that's why here t comma r r r is called in return r r result here what is the method is there applied in apply okay, input is okay, input argument to t apply input is okay, input argument to t output is output is r input is okay, input argument to t output is rt output is r interface function t comma r see now here see need not to okay, return here any boolean team it returns any type of value here it returns any type of value here input also is maybe any type of input here any type of okay, input here understood no simple example team how the okay, example is there in here only i will start function your input may be a string output may be a integer integer so s colon s dot length t that's it now what you will do f dot apply okay f dot apply f dot apply then then what is your value here srinu what is your value here srinu so okay, output you will get it output you will get it 16. See. Please try to understand. When I should go for when we should go for predicate and function team. When we should go for predicate and function. Answer is answer is a okay, very very important team. Answer is and I should go for a predicate and function team. Hey, if, if we want filter the data, 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 that is out of n elements out of n elements out of n elements if you want to filter the data out of n elements the result may be out of n elements if you want to filter the data that is out of n elements out of n elements the result may be the result may be n or n minus 1 or n minus 2 and so on means example if your list to have 10 elements if you apply this filter after filter apply then 
10 r pi of r three elements okay depends 10 r pi of r and three elements okay depends understood team if i want if i want if you want to filter the data then out of n elements that the result may be this 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 then you should go for predicate t to filter the data if you want to filter the data use predicate use predicate use predicate t very, very important t if you want to filter the data use predicate t okay next one t now here see if you want apply if you want apply it simply will tell if we don't want if you don't filter the data but for the logic should apply for apply for all the elements all the elements logic should be applied for all the elements logic should be applied for all the elements if you don't filter the data if you don't filter the data okay and 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 the logic the logic should apply for logic should apply to all the elements if you don't filter the data that means if you give okay input is okay input is n elements input is n elements input is again okay, n, n elements apply some logic output is output also n elements only output n elements is the result is the resultant output output is n elements with resultant output to team with resultant output to team please try to understand team it is very very important please try to understand team it is a very very important team understood team hope you are good everything is good now now we will see practicals now okay, you will be able to know when we should go for predicate and when you should go for functionality when you should go for predicate and when you should go for functionality okay team now now we'll see we'll see one simple use case com dot cinotech simple example we will write today we will see tomorrow more team now we are seeing function you can take whatever you want string you can take whatever you want string input is string output is string that means s colon input is string out thing s colon what you should do here you can give s dot s dot s dot concat xt some dot out dot print ln f dot apply if you give Serino it will concat and output will give Serino take output will give Serino take now here a interested one is let me take one simple uh, list here or string array string array s is equal to, I want to give all my names 
Srinu. I want to give all my names Srinu. Now I have or Srinu. I want to give some, okay. I want to give some fruits like anything, apple, orange. I want to give fruits like, you know, mango, and so on, something. I should apply what this function interface. Function interface. Input is string. Input is string. And output also it would be string. Of here f1 is equal to s colon s dot and cat Good. you can write team predicate and functional combinations also i will explain and to write a predicate and combination look i will explain all you should mix up both Cannot redeclare that. Okay. Somewhere you have S is there. Okay. Here I will give fruits to you. How to write our business logic for each loop? String fruit, colon fruits. fruits now here here i should apply my business logic team system dot out dot print ln no if condition here it should applicable for all the okay all the all the list of data it should be applicable for all the list of data team. so i'm just appending space apple fruits orange fruit mango fruit see here if you want to apply your logic in all the if you want to apply your logic in all the elements of your list, all the elements of your list, then we should go for function. Function of input may be any and output may be anything. Whereas in predicate, always output will be Boolean team. Always output will be Boolean team. Depends upon the requirement you should go. If you want to only perform some okay, conditions, blindly go for predicate, no. If you want to perform some business logic in all the elements, all the elements, you know, and also, so, uh, you know, where input is maybe anything and output is maybe any kind of data type, then we should go for, we should go for function interface team. Understood? Okay. Now, tomorrow I will explain, tomorrow I will explain what is the difference between predicate and function few few examples how to use predicate how to use functions few examples how to use only with the function collections same here also you have function one way arguments function two way arguments and function primitive types are there all will discuss tomorrow team